Good morning, YouTube! Bear with me, I got a little bit of a cold, so I'm stuffed up a little bit, but uh, I want to do a video this morning as I just saw something appalling online. It's relevant to uh, craft cheese slices. So I make food for my son all the time, and I, I'm not going to lie, the, the cheese slices, it's a big part of a lot of stuff we do. Sometimes if he won't eat his eggs, we'll melt a little slice of cheese on top, and he devours it. Who doesn't feed their kids grilled cheese? And who doesn't use Kraft Singles for the grilled cheese? Even on top of that, we've been buying the fat-free kind, you know, trying to even give the healthier option. But one of the things that uh, we should think about here is that it doesn't say Kraft Single Slices or Kraft Cheese Slices. It says Kraft Singles. So that's pretty deceiving. Here's cheese everywhere, grilled cheese, all that fun stuff. But the fact of the matter is, as a disclaimer, they're not calling it cheese. It says right here, processed cheese product. So this, this stuff doesn't burn. That scares the hell out of me. No wonder everybody has cancer today. Let's take whatever we can and just stuff it down our children's throats or sell it to the consumer. That seems to be what's going on with all these big chain stores. But uh, the fact that you cannot burn cheese, I, I think it's, it's hideous and horrendous. So what we're gonna do right now is we are gonna burn the cheese. We're gonna do it with a lighter and see what happens. And then I'm going to do a comparable. So before we freak out on it, we're actually going to try the regular cheese that you would buy in the store. And we'll make sure that that's a happy place too. So let's go in this and figure it out. Because I'm telling you what, like, if that stuff's terrible for my, my kids, like, you know, it's just not going to happen no more. I think it's despicable that they're selling stuff like that to the consumer with the grilled cheese on the front. So clearly we're pushing it towards children. And they know that it's really, really not good stuff. We can go into a whole other aspect there too, like uh, Cheese Whiz. Cheese Whiz is supposed to be like one molecule away from being plastic or something. That is some pretty terrible crap, but that's a whole other deal. Let's get into this and start burning some okay, stuff. Okay, first up, we're gonna go with the orange cheese. Let's see if I can do this without burning my fingers. So it's sizzling. A little snap, crackle, pop action. You would think that it would melt as if I put it, or. Well, it's obviously going to melt, but it's not going to burn. So it won't burn. It melts and makes a sizzling... Oops, I ripped it. Melts and makes a little sizzling noise, but it doesn't catch fire. Okay. Little sizzling noise. No fire. Okay, that's the orange one. Unbelievable, man. Here's the white one. Maybe this will be different. It's mozzarella. Or it's processed cheese mozzarella product. Look at that. You know, that's, that's really scary stuff. It's very concerning. You know, everybody is sick these days. And I wonder why. Look at that. It smokes. It smolders. It will not burn. That is it, folks. I mean, we're just, it's despicable that they're giving us crap like this to feed to our kids. It's just disgusting. It goes to show you the quality of the cheese that they're selling. Like this stuff here, as soon as I put the lighter to it, it instantly starts to melt. Okay? It starts dripping. And it's doing like a flame torch thing. See it? That's burning. That's absolutely burning. I don't know what to say, folks. I mean, I just think that that's disgusting. It doesn't even drip. Like when I put the lighter to it, it doesn't drip. If you throw it in the microwave, it's going to melt over the top, but it's not even dripping when I light it. So I just think that's disgusting, and I don't think you should be feeding it to your kids. So beware of it. You know, and be conscious of the things that they represent as real cheese, when in fact are not even anything close to it. Thanks a lot for watching. Please subscribe to my channel.